Hi there, my name is Samuel and today on the one day I decided to take a break, of course the season 14 trailer, or is it season 14 trailer, comes out and of course this was going to happen, like why would life make it any easier, but yes I'm filming this in the evening because I want to, like honestly, I've kind of, it's felt weird not actually doing any real like videoing today, like I know that sometimes I pre-record but the fact I didn't have anything going up felt really weird and I felt a bit like, oh I kind of want to do a video but then I was like no, take a rest, but yeah the season 14, is it season 14 as I keep saying? trailer did it get released so quickly we're gonna break the trailer down and then i'll talk about what's going on because indeed this is not season 14 but this is like a prologue to season 14 which i really like the idea of it's like a mini 45 minute movie roughly 44 minutes but which sets up the next season being season 14 with which being mia's season so i think that's actually just incredible and it's uh, sort of was right when i said about the suits overlapping is because i think they will like it's literally imagine day of the departed but if they kind of carried it over like that was just the beginning of the story how they kept the suits so i think that is honestly incredible i really like the idea and this is still not 100 confirmed until lego directly say it but from all the information we do have that is exactly what it looks like it is indicating so now let's break down the trailer so to start out in my disappointment we see the season 11 suits which is really annoying and then we see the leader of the explorers club saying that misako montgomery garmadon yes lloyd's middle name lloyd montgomery garmadon it's actually from misako which is a new like character fact that we never knew has basically gone missing and he says it in that really weird voice i don't know what it is his voice sounds really often it sounds really sinister like maybe we've got another dr sanders which literally could be another one of them and you've got pixel there which is really cool to see and then in the next scene it does say sensei Wu, me sango and clutch powers and i believe there's one more not really sure who that character is yet we don't have a name but yeah you can see them like doing a bit of exploring is this clutch powers or is this an article i don't know considering that clutch was out of retirement i don't know why he's back like right, he has no motive this time so well i guess he might be kicked out of the guild so that's why that makes sense makes sense that masako's there and then it shows you the other shot of like the totem pole just in the middle and it's like locking them in there in that place which is weird then of course when the ninja hear that there is trouble they are of course gonna go and save their friends with this really awesome dynamic looking shot from the, like the bounty which i really love the look of that shot and the fact that they're wearing their like season 14 suits look absolutely amazing these genuinely i think are my favorites like these are just so colorful and so different like many different colors it's just so great honestly and then we meet this new person which Ma, we know a new elemental power should be getting revealed this year i think it's him honestly if we look here in this shot you can see it has this logo on his back like exactly like elemental master logos it's circle and it's got an eagle so i think he's potentially got the power of bird as silly as that sound it would make sense so huge dove would have potentially or shadowed this and then we got this person so to me that perfectly makes sense that this could be an elemental master of bird It'd be quite funny and maybe this is why Fuji dove think this is happening because yeah it could be it's got that logo and it's got little notches and marks on it and in the description it does mention about help from another ninja so mm, that's all i can say about that it seems very interesting master of bird it makes sense that someone who could fly and we've never had an elemental master who could fly so that's another thing that would make sense we quite funny if you can't see glass i think they can make some great laughs out of that and he sort of seems his personality that you do get to sort of see in the trailer get a glimpse of which is very interesting and i'm really excited like i honestly can't wait to see who exactly this ninja is so that is really cool and how did the ninja actually know about him anyway moving on you can see we have jay who looks like he has been captured he's wearing like a bench stone what do you want it necklace i guess so so that looks really cool it seems very interesting then we can see the destiny bounty fly into the storm which sort of reminds me of the only cloud then we see this awesome shot of this island that looks absolutely incredible the way the sun's breaking through you then see the ninja are all tied up you have clutch powers misago and Wu there so they find them yep they do find them but of course they end up getting caught in the process then we see the stuff where you can see clutch powers all in article and this new fella trying to i don't know nick the net and yeah yeah i guess they are trying to but why would they be doing that because this is like an ancient tribe and so far they've not caused any issues so um Hmm, interesting. Maybe this is Nardagon trying to get more enemies to the ninja. So why they're like making new enemies and focusing on these, he's gonna kidnap Jay and try and marry Nia. That could happen. So anyway, moving on, you can then see this awesome shot of him like using his self, which looks like it does the will. You can see that we have the ninja captured and this really awesome zoomed up shot of him, which I like, and there is a shot of the amulet, which looks really cool. And then you have like a storm with like looks like the destiny bounty. It sort of reminds me of Garmadon's version, which is really cool. We've got a vehicle off to the right, and this amazing shot of which I think I would have preferred 
heard on the box and the one we got, I don't know, just quite simple, really cool. Then we got this awesome shot of Chief Mermatas with like his purple glowing. So I presume that's ha what happens when Jay powers them up. Then we have a shot of them using Spinjitsu, which is really cool against one of like the tribal warrior things. You got a shot of the bridge, which is really cool. And I like that for the jungle. It seems really cool. We got this like one of the dragon, which looks really cool. Like the jungle dragon. It doesn't have a name, I believe, but it seems like it's going to be really goofy. So that is interesting. I don't know why I keep going to call it Chompy. I don't know why, considering that was from season 13. So yeah, that is really awesome. And then we got this a final shot of the ninja teaming up with Nia at the front. We've got Jay in the back. And then you've got Lloyd in the middle, which is really cool. And that is the trailer. Then it ends with this brand new logo, which honestly looks incredible. And wow, that was a trailer. I was literally on the edge of my seat. It was incredible. Finally, some new content to see. And yeah, this trailer looks amazing. So what I've decided to do as I've just gone through editing this video, I sort of do it as I go. I've decided there's a lot of information to talk about in like, a description of the season. So I'm going to do that as another video that you will see today. So that will be its separate own video. I've sort of gone through a bit of it, but there's quite a lot of information. So I think it'd be better. But just to split it up into two videos, because I'm not sure what would I describe this video as like the Ninjago I Island special trailer slash information i don't know so i'll do it in two videos so if you want to see it it'll be a few hours from that i'm recording this sort of like in am just sort of from the evening over that kind of way i'm doing it so this video will go out sort of early ish and then the later part me talking about breaking down the information i'll do it later in the evening so that is it for now and i will catch up with you with the more information after the break in the next video i'll see you there bye for now